29 June 2021 according to the English calendar and 15 Asar according to the Nepali calendar the day where all the Nepali people worldwide eat dahi and chura Do you know what is the best thing about owning a store you get to eat new new stuff so this is a biscuit that I've never eaten before and well the wholesaler was telling that it is quite famous in the retail industry right now so let me try it two biscuits and in the middle it's cheese and five bucks for this thing yeah bro it's quite good done with collecting the monthly ration for this month and now heading straight towards home and after going home i'm going to be having my breakfast which is going to be dahi and chura what is dahi dahi is curd chura means flattened rice and why exactly do we eat dahi and chura on this particular day i'll be explaining you today itself thank you you are welcome bhanna cha a gara a gara lo what is your name my name is aradya dal where do you study I study in Saint Joseph Convent. Not Saint Joseph is Saint Joseph's Convent. What type of Joseph Convent? Joseph's. Joseph's. Convent. Convent. And uh, how old are you? I am six, six years old. Six years old. Is sixty? Six. You look like sixty. Why are you thinking so much when you have to tell six? <laughs> you might as well just tell sixty years old, right? Hmm. Hmm. That day, what day? Hmm. What day? Hmm. Good girl. Now go. Why Nepalese worldwide eat dahi and chura on this particular day? That is 15th Asar, 15th Asar ka din. Our great grandparents, our ancestors used to be farmers, and they used to cultivate dhan, that is rice, on this particular day. And to cultivate the rice, the most important thing that is needed is water. And on this particular day, our mother nature used to shower us with lots of rainfall. When it used to rain nicely, the entire families used to be busy in the rice fields. so they didn't really get time to make lunch at home and during those times curd that is dahi was readily available at every household and even chura which is flattened rice it was made at home itself so dahi and chura used to be a substitute for lunch and as chura is made of rice it used to be very healthy and well it used to take a lot of time to digest as well so in order to work the entire day they used to have dahi and chura So basically, that is the history of the dahi and chura, and why exactly do we eat dahi and chura on this particular day? It has actually become a kind of tradition. Many people from India who speak Nepali, and many Nepali people from Nepal, they have a question that why do I always make vlogs in English? Why do I hardly vlog in Nepali? The reason is this: at first, I started vlogging because I wanted people to visit our Kalimpong, and after that, I started experimenting on my vlogs. And the other thing that I wanted to do was. I wanted to make the people of other communities aware of our community and how our tradition, how our culture is. And since then, I have been making vlogs about the Sai Diwali, that is Tihar, and what we do at that particular day. And as today is supposed to be the day of Dahi and Chura, that is Pandra Asar, this is one perfect opportunity for me to let people of other communities know exactly why we do this. And I'm very sure that not many people from our own generation know the exact reason why we eat this. So well, here is the answer. If I had made vlogs about a culture in Nepal, then for sure, people of our generation they would learn so many new things about a culture, right? But people of other communities they wouldn't be aware of any such thing about a culture, about a tradition. So that is the only reason why I started vlogging in English, and right now too I'm vlogging in English. So please don't hate me that I vlog in English. All right, I know how to speak Nepali. I know really well. So this was entirely about my today's day because now I'm gonna enjoy my dahi and chura and on this particular day itself I'm gonna be releasing this vlog. So I'll see you folks directly on the vlog. So thank you so much for making me a part of your day. Until next time, this is your brother, the vlogger from the hills, Priyam Gurung, and I will see you very very soon. Till then, take care, bye bye, and cheers to life. Thank you so much. And yes, fellow folks. The mini bar that you see out there, not my. That's my dad's. 
Tchau.